Uh, I want to point out to you guys this little section right here on your second floor. Um, so we have two bedrooms, and those two bedrooms have closets associated with them. So I already showed you how to do room bounding, um, and uh, basically, like, how do you how do you let the room leak into something that's uh, ancillary to the main space, right? Like a closet. Um, so. Uh, Basically, there's a difference between what we did on the first floor and what we have to do here. We actually have to split the wall before we make it room bounding, uh, before we turn off room bounding, rather. Um, so if I take this wall and I turn off room bounding entirely, you're going to see a bunch of errors pop up, right? Those two bedrooms leak into each other, so that's a problem. Um, this bedroom leaks into both closets, and that's not what I want. So. Um, the objective is to break this wall, so I need to break it up into bits and pieces so that the correct room leaks into the correct closet. So um, I'm going to take this wall and split that in half, and uh, basically I can take this and that segment and turn those off of room bounding. Uh, technically I don't even have to do both actually. I could just take this wall and turn that off, and that's going to leak in. Right, you can, you can do that, that'll be fine. Um, <clears throat> but then this one is a continuous wall all the way down, so you don't want to turn that off of room bounding because it's going to leak into the bathroom, the closet, and the study. So, uh, and the study will leak into the bedroom too. So um, I'm going to click that, uh, the split element, and then I'm going to clip this wall right there and right here, and just take that segment, and I'm going to turn that off of room bounding. So now, this bedroom leaks into its closet, and this bedroom leaks into its closet. Is that clear? Okay, so um, fortunately for us, the, uh, the closet next to the master bedroom is, um, is its own room, so we don't have to worry about that. And then uh, the other thing I just want to point out is I use the room boundary lines to cut off the study at the railing. All right, so this is our objective. We want to get here before we proceed with some other visibility items. Okay, Kevin.